When I made my mark, some of my gifts of soul, or gifts of spirit, as noted in the Bible, I have to say that people started to get a little bit unnerved, because there are those moments in time when God puts us on a path with someone, and it's totally innocent, and it's totally perfect, and it's totally everything it's supposed to be. But there are people who are called profilers, and they study people like you and me. And they do so for a potential to manipulate, to educate, and to, well, sometimes eradicate our lives. You see, we have opportunities to use our gifts to help people. Not everyone who has gifts of soul that are gifted by the Lord Most High acknowledges them because they know, like you and I, that many people in the world will make fun of them. The truth is only a powerful God has the ability to give such gifts of prophecy or what I like to call the minority report concept where someone gets information in advance of something happening. At the same time, we have clairaudience, clairalience, clairvoyance, and many others, even empathy, which can be some sort of a empathic, gets a sense of feeling of something. But I don't have to take you through the eight clairs. You can look that up online yourself. That is sort of a more metaphysical or more spirituality-based way of looking at the gifts that the Lord gives us and are noted both in the Bible and the Quran and other works around the world. Every country and every nation has information on things like that in their history throughout time. To presume that God doesn't still do that is a foolish thing to do.